hey guys it's Edna welcome back to my youtube channel so as you guys can tell by the title of this video i'll be doing a shein haul today which i'm so excited to do because i've honestly been wanting new clothes for such a long time so don't mind the fact that i'm wearing a robe right now i just didn't want to start wearing any of the clothes before i started doing this shein haul basically i ordered over 20 items but i'm not sure that i'm going to be trying everything on because some of the things that i did order were jewelry or bathing suits and i'm not sure that i want to actually wear the bathing suits on camera but i'm going to be trying on a majority of the clothes so that you guys can get a feel of how Shein clothes are and I've actually been ordering clothes from Shein for over like two or three years now not just recently and I would say that their clothes have been like really good for me in the past but because so many people are buying from Shein now I'm not sure if their quality is still the same but that's what we're gonna try out in this haul today I'm sorry I'm throwing clothes everywhere literally oh uh, let me show you guys the amount of clothes I got but anyway yeah these are all the clothes I have try on for you guys it's probably gonna take me a while that's okay that's what this haul is for so that i can do all the work and you guys don't have to so let me stop talking and let's start this video okay guys so the first piece of clothing i'll be showing you is this hot wheels graphic tee that i got from shein i actually think this is one of my favorites because it's like really comfortable the quality is really good i like i'm not sure if you guys can see it but i like the design that's like on the front and i just paired it with a pair of biker shorts that i bought a while ago this is how the shirt looks from the back. And I think it's very comfortable. It has a nice neckline. The colors really pop, but it's not too much. I think you can wear this like if you want to go out grocery shopping or just hanging out with some friends. Like this would be a very cute fit. So I actually think this is one of my favorites, but I can't even say that now because I actually haven't taken out any of the clothes out of the Ziploc bag. So I'm just taking out the clothes as I go. But I actually opened this one yesterday when the clothes came because I needed a graphic tee to go out. And I actually really like this one. So this is number one and i think it's cute okay so for the next piece of clothing we have i have another graphic tee i'm gonna try to do all the graphic tees before i do all the regular clothes because i don't want to have to keep changing my outfits and i love wearing graphic tees with like biker shirts so we have this other graphic tee it has um I don't know people drawn on it i guess <laughs> in red and blue um this one runs a little bigger i tried to look at the size on this but i couldn't see what the size was but all the clothes i've um ordered from sheen were either extra small or small i didn't get anything other than that um sheen runs true to size so if you're an extra small get an extra small don't get anything bigger because it'll be a little bigger um i really like this shirt it looks really cute it's comfortable um, once again, I would wear this going out. I'm really getting into graphic tees because I hate having to dress up. So like graphic tees are just something you could just throw on. Oh, and if you guys see me looking here, it's because I have a mirror here, but I should be looking at you guys. But um, this is really cute as well. Obviously, you would pair it with like gold jewelry. I always wear gold jewelry. Um, it's cute. It has writing on the front. I'll come a little closer so you guys can see the design. It's really cute. I like this one too. And I like the way like it like fits me, but it's kind of baggy. It gives you that like baggy look. Um, so yeah, that's about it for this shirt. And let me try something else out for you guys. Okay, so I'm kind of excited about this one because I forgot that I bought this shirt. So it's kind of like a graphic tee, but I would call it a graphic crop top because obviously it's a crop top. Um, this is the style on the front. So it has like these waves on the bottom in blue and like a blue butterfly. I would pair these with like ripped jeans that are like fitted at the top but kind of baggy at the bottom um i really like this shirt because it really fits like the top like it's not like one of those baggy crop tops at the front um i like how the design is not too much i really like this shirt a lot the quality feels really good as well yeah you can wear this if you're like going out to eat with friends or like even to class somewhere cute like this is a really cute this is actually a really cute fit i might wear it today <laughs> But yeah, I really like this shirt as well. I don't usually get graphic tees, as you guys can tell, but I've been buying a lot of graphic tees lately. And I'm pretty sure this is the last one that I had. But yeah, this one's very cute as well. And I'm pretty sure I got this one in an extra small. So it fits really well, and it's also like very comfortable and stretchy. So yeah. Okay guys, so I actually ended up having another graphic tee. This is another graphic crop top. It says California West Coast. I do not know why I would buy a California shirt. I probably liked it because of the tie dye, but I don't really know how much I like this one because it's kind of like hard to find things to like match with it. Like obviously I paired it with biker shirts, but I honestly I would probably wear it with like 
dark blue ripped jeans but i don't like it as much as i liked all the other ones but it is cute so i'll give it that okay guys so up next we have this nice crop top it's ribbed in the middle i'm not sure if you guys can see that but it comes with these things it didn't come like this like these things are detachable and i ended up tying it over here i hope like that's how you're supposed to wear it but i really like it i paired it with bell bottoms because i felt like this top was a little more like not so casual so i wanted to wear it with something like that's not so much casual this is how the back of it looks it's really cute honestly and i like how it's like v-neck but not too deep and it's ripped in the middle um the quality of this is actually really good as well um yeah but that's all for this top and let me wear the next one okay so next up we have this yellow bandeau top i really love bandeaus because they're so easy to put on and go out with um the back of it is wider than the front which is a little surprising it's ripped as you guys can see yellow um this is also an extra small and i would just pair it with high-waisted ripped jeans um they're very cute Oh, and I just wanted to say my hair probably looks messy because I keep like putting on and taking on clothes, so do not worry about that. But something weird about it is that it came with this yellow strap. And I'm not sure what you're supposed to do with this. Maybe like, oh, it would be cute if you like wore it right here. Oh, that would be so cute, guys. Like if you wore it here, like a little accessory. I'm guessing i don't know why they gave this to me you guys know i'm a little slow but yeah this top is cute as well i like it i would wear this like if i'm going out to a brunch or something oh i'm sorry i keep looking there i'm supposed to be looking at you guys but yeah i'll wear it if i'm going out to a brunch or something i really like it so up next we have another bandeau top this one's different from the other one in that like this one i'm not sure if you guys can see it it's kind of has like a knitted pattern and the front of it is wider than the back which is what i usually like for bandeau tops i would also pair this with like ripped jeans or something if my hair is messy guys just ignore that i just keep putting on and taking off clothes again so my hair is getting really frizzy but yeah I like this bandeau top too. I'm pretty sure this is a small. I think the other, the yellow one I wore was an extra small and this is just a small. So it fits a little looser, but it's also very cute. And I think this is the last bandeau top I got. It's gray. Um, it's kind of ribbed, but not as ribbed as the yellow one. This one's also very cute. That's how it looks in the back. I would also pair this with like ripped jeans, high-waisted ripped jeans. Um, the quality of this is very good. I like this one because it's tighter fitted. Like I feel more secure. And yeah, that's all for this shirt it's really nice honestly i'll probably wear this if i'm going like out to eat maybe outdoors or something like it's summertime honestly i could wear bandeau tops anywhere like they're just so easy to put on and go out with hey guys so next up we have this dress that i bought i'm actually kind of excited for this dress because i'm usually used to wearing like very fitted dresses that don't really flow but this one flows at the bottom but i really like it because it's like fitted it has one shoulder the quality of this dress is also very very nice that's how it looks from the back and i like this dress because it has these two i'm not sure if you guys can see that but it has these two strings that you can like pull to adjust and make the dress like come up on one side so i would probably like use it up to right here and then tie it this dress is honestly so cute i think this has to be one of my favorites oh my gosh this dress is so nice it fits really well i like the one shoulder i like the side how it comes up like this and it's just like really good quality like i'm not used to wearing dresses like this but i would definitely wear this outside like it's really cute honestly i'm probably gonna wear this today to be honest but yeah okay so up next i have this cheetah print is this cheetah print i don't know i think wait what's the other animal that's like a cheetah but it's not a cheetah leopard no, but this can't be leopard print. I think it's cheetah print. Anyway, up next, I have this cheetah print crop top that I have. Um, I'm not sure how I really feel about it. I feel like it doesn't give me enough coverage in the front. Like, I felt like this part could have probably been a little longer to go down a little more. Um, and I couldn't wear a bra under it because my bra was showing because there's not enough coverage in the front. The back of it is really nice, though. But I decided to get this shirt because I feel like I don't have enough cheetah print kind of clothing. Um, I would wear this with high jeans only because it's not enough coverage in the front so I would want to wear it with something that kind of like covers a little bit. I would probably have to wear this top to like the beach with like some beach pants or something because I feel like I wouldn't be comfortable wearing this outside. But yeah, I really like this top. I don't like it as much as the other ones. I think I feel like kind of okay with it. 
But yeah, that's it for this top. Okay, up next we have one of my favorite tops that I saw online. I'm so excited of how it looks in person. So this is kind of like a graphic tee, but it's not really a tee. I would call it like a graphic blouse. Um, I like the style that it has on the front. Obviously, you would not wear this shirt with any type of bra underneath, I feel like, because look at how nice the back is. So it has this kind of like arched back, but like it comes around because it has these ties at the back. I really love this top. I feel like you can wear this somewhere very nice. It's very different from any top like I've really seen other people wear. Um, I really, really like it. It fits well. The quality is nice. I like how it has like a kind of high neck. So it's not very V neck. So it's kind of high neck, but like it really contrasts with the back. And honestly, I would probably wear this. You could probably wear this with any type of pants, low rise, high rise, whatever you would want to wear it with. Oh my gosh, I keep looking at myself in the mirror and my hair looks so crazy, guys. I'm sorry. But yeah, I really, really love this top. This has to be like one of my favorites from Shein. Um, it's really cute. It did not disappoint. It looks exactly how like it looked on the model when I was online shopping. And I just really like this. Okay guys, so up next we have this white crop top that I bought, which I'm kind of upset about because I actually have a top just like this, so I don't know why I would buy a top like this. And I'm upset because this quality isn't as good as the one that I do have, and the shirt was one, very difficult to get on, and two, it's kind of see-through, so I'm not sure if you guys can see this, but it has like, you can see like where the fabric stops and starts again, which I don't like about it. Um, I just find this top very like not put together very well but I did decide to pair it with this double layered necklace that I did buy from Shein obviously their jewelry isn't real but I wanted to buy some jewelry just so I can try it on with outfits so that you guys can see I also paired it with some bracelets that I bought um honestly I don't know why I would buy these bracelets they're obviously very low quality and some of like the bracelet sets so this does not like click in well and I have very small wrists so it's kind of difficult to wear so like Overall, I really do not like this shirt. I think it's very low quality. I don't like the bracelets, but I do like the double layered necklace that I did buy. So that is a plus side to this outfit. Okay, so I'm pretty sure this is one of the last boxes that I bought, but it's a nice little crop top, a little crop top, obviously. Um, it has a V-neck. I like the ruffles that it has over here. It's red. It has like a floral pattern. I'm not sure if you guys can see that, but I think this top is very cute. And what I like about it is that you can wear it in two ways. So this is the first way that I would probably wear it. But there's another way that you can also wear this top that I'm about to show you guys. And I think that way is kind of cute. But this top is really cute. Um, the quality is kind of medium compared to the other tops that I had. Obviously, some of the tops had better quality than some of the other ones. Um, this one has a medium quality. It's like not horrible, but it's not like some of the best that I did it. So this is obviously the other way in which you can wear this top that I just showed you guys before. Um, I'm not sure which way I do prefer. I think it just depends on what bottoms you're wearing and where you have to go. But honestly, this top is cute. I feel like you could just throw it on very easily. And I do like it. I like the color. The color's different. Um, I don't really have tops this kind of color. It's kind of like a wineish red. But yeah, it's cute and I like it. Once again, the quality of this shirt is medium compared to all the other qualities of the other shirts that I had. But I'm pretty sure this is the last top I have. And then I have two more dresses to show you guys. And I'm probably going to be done with this video. Okay, so this is another dress that I did end up buying. Obviously, it's different from the dresses that I'm used to wearing. So I wanted to try something different. Um, it's yellow. The quality of this dress isn't all that great. Obviously, I would have to steam it. It just came out of the packaging. I kind of feel like a little subconscious wearing it because I feel like it's really short even for me. But I feel like it's very cute for like if you have to go to a picnic or somewhere cute to like take pictures. I would probably hold it with like a purse like this. Oh, that would be so cute. I would hold it with a purse like this. I like the color of it. I would definitely wear this outside though. And yeah, I would just say that what I don't like about this dress is the quality of it like i feel like it could be a little thicker or have like a deeper lining or something but i do like the cut of it i like how like it goes in and then goes out and i feel like the dress is meant to be short like this is the kind of style of dress it's supposed to be but yeah i have one more dress and then that's probably gonna be all for this video okay so this is the last dress that i have and the last clothing item that i have to try on for you guys today i'm very happy with the way this dress came out these are the type of dresses i'm actually used to wearing they're bodycon um they're medium length not too short not too long i love the way this dress fits in the back it really like grips on i'm pretty sure this is a small or extra small of course like i said before i'm gonna be putting either I don't know what side of the camera I'm going to put it on, but I'm going to be putting the screenshots of these dresses. I like the color of the blue it is. 
um the quality is medium i was a little scared because usually when you buy it off websites like this like body con dresses especially they can be see-through this isn't like completely solid but it isn't completely see-through either which is good because i can wear it outside and yeah i really love the way this dress fits it's really cute and i'll probably wear this like to a party or something but yeah this is my last dress and i've decided that i'm not going to try on the bathing suits but i did decide i'm going to show you guys the bathing suits and the anklets that i bought just so you guys can have a look at them so the sheen anklets that i bought well this is a necklace but um the anklets that i bought they come in little packages like this which is very cute they're ziplocked kind of anyway this is one of the is this an anklet yeah this is one of why is this so big oh no this is an anklet wait is it is this supposed to, I think it's supposed to be like a butterfly choker necklace. This isn't an anklet. I'm sorry guys. This is like a butterfly choker necklace that I bought because I wanted more like butterfly stuff. They're so cute. So this is one of the things that I bought. This is the anklet that I bought. I bought this butterfly anklet because I have a gold anklet, but I want, I'm not sure if you guys can see that, but I wanted a silver one. So I have this one. And then let me show you guys the bathing suits that I bought. So I'm pretty sure I only got like three bathing suits. So the bathing suits come in little bags like this. It's called Shein Bikini, which is really so cute. I love Shein's packaging because they all come in like little Ziplocs and little cute bags. So this is the first bathing suit that I got. Oh, the blue is so pretty. It's like a baby blue. This has padding in it. And it's like a triangle top. And this is the bottom of it. I think the bottoms might be a little too big for me, but it does have adjustable straps on the side. So we'll see when I do end up wearing it. And then I also got this red bathing suit. I don't really like the way the cups look. I mean, I guess it's okay. I don't usually get cups like this, but this is okay, I guess. It also has pads, but you can take out the pads, which I like. And this is the bottom of that bathing suit. Honestly, these I'm probably going to have to shrink. Actually, probably not. <laughs> probably not. I think they'll fit, but yeah. I got this, and then I got one more bathing suit. I thought I ordered more bathing suits. I'm not sure. This probably has to be my favorite. So it has gold chains on the side. This is the bottom. It's so cute. Like The fabric is really nice on this one. It's black, and it's like clothy. And then it comes with this top which is also very cute i hope this top fits me it's probably gonna fit but this no this one is actually let me see if i can like show you guys this one's actually so cute i really like this one i love the chains on it basically i went through all the clothes that i had for you guys today this haul i feel like is all oh my gosh this haul i feel like is all over the place because it's my first haul i'm not used to doing it but obviously i'll be doing more hauls in the future and i'll get better at showing you guys the clothes overall i would say i liked all the clothes from shein the quality was pretty good especially for their price it came pretty true to size um there was only about two or three clothes that i didn't absolutely love but everything else i pretty much loved make sure to like comment and subscribe on this video and i'll see you guys on my next one bye